Now, today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hi, everybody. Let's take a look at today's top stories. A Dover man has pleaded guilty to killing a bald eagle. U.S. attorneys say 79-year-old David Hoff shot and killed that bald eagle with a rifle while checking out his land in Tuscaroras County last year. Then he left it in a neighboring field. Hoff agreed to give $10,000 to the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation, pay another $10,000 in fines, too. He'll also be prohibited from hunting for five years when he's sentenced in October. The former mayor of Newburgh Heights will spend one month behind bars. Trevor Elkins sentenced after taking a plea deal earlier this year. A state elections commission investigation found he used more than $134,000 of campaign funds for personal use between 2015 and 2019. Elkins claimed the money wasn't from donors. Instead, it was his own money he deposited into the campaign account. Elkins was also ordered to serve 200 hours of community service, fined $3,000, and agreed not to run for office again until after 2028. More than 100 vintage cars made their way across the Buckeye State. It's part of the annual Great Race, a nine-day, 2,300-mile trek from Rhode Island to North Dakota. Today is day four. It all stopped in Medina before heading on to Perrysburg to spend the night. Nice day for a drive. Pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, as long as you did. Those cars have AC back then. I don't know if they had roofs. Yeah, that's true. All right, we'll be near 90 again tomorrow. There's a slim chance for a thunderstorm, especially southern portions of our viewing area tomorrow. Just plan on it being hot, muggy, and dry for the most part. 91, feeling more like 100. Cooler Thursday, a warm, mainly dry weekend. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.